In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can compute uh, an area from a figure series of points in Field Genius. Uh, and also, it's going to be one of the error messages that you might see when doing so when computing areas with irregular shapes. So, let's get started. We'll go to Calculations, Area Calculator. And we're going to go to Determine Area. So, what we want to do is the parallel method. And so, first, we're going to just define our area. So in this case, our area starts at point 1, and we'll just work around here, we have to point 3. Now we don't have to close back on point 1 here. So this is the area that we want to work with. So if we go to calculate area now, you can see I have an area of about 2800 square meters. So what I want to do now is compute an area of 1000 meters, and I want the direction to be 90. So what that's going to do is compute uh, from this line going straight 90 as we move up. So if we do calculate, you may see this error message fail to determine area. So if I look back at the map, the reason it's giving that error message is because the area falls below 0.4 and when it's computing the area it's using this baseline here and this one here. And because it falls below 0.4, it's not able to compute the area down there. So if I were to change this to 2,000 meters, for example, calculate, you'll see that a solution was found. And if you look at map view, you can see where it is. In this case, it works because the baseline falls above uh, between points 3 and 4. Now, it still uses the full area of the figure here. It doesn't continue down to calculate the 2,000 meters. So in this case, we want to do 1,000 meter uh, solution for this figure. Now that we've seen an error message, what we can do is we'll change this back to 1,000, and we'll just redefine the area. And we move to the previous one. So in this case, we're going to do the same thing, but we're going to end at point 4 because we don't need that top section there. Now that we're finished, we'll do calculate. You can see now that a solution was found. If you look at the map, you can see the line that computed here, calculating the area of 1000.